normal is the one place you No, that ain't normal. Exactly oh my god, and that ain't normal either. Oh, oh shit, didn't see you there. What's going on? Welcome back to another video, guys. Uh, today's video, we're actually looking at the best of the linebackers. Um, if you're an NFL fan, if you're a college football fan, if you're a rugby fan, if you're an AFL fan, if you're a rugby league fan, if you're a rugby sevens fan, if you're a touch rugby fan, um, if you're a CFL fan, and that's about all the oval ball sports I can think of. If you're any of those fans, you may be a fan of this video too. I'm a rugby player. Um, <clears throat> I haven't graced the field in about a year, but I am a rugby player and uh, a very proud one. Um, I'm coming to you from New Zealand, which is a rugby mad country, and uh, I'm doing my best to spread the word, spread the word of rugby around the world. And one thing I decided to do on a fateful night about two years ago was look up NFL. I decided to not only look at it and watch it just like anyone else would do, but I decided to download a screen recorder, record what I'm watching, and turn on my Canon 80D as well. We spliced those videos together and Rugby Player Reacts as a series was born. It's been an absolutely amazing ride. It really has, and I want to thank you guys for that. If nothing else happens, if, 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 if my level of internet fame, or whatever you want to call it, never goes above what it is now, I'm completely happy. I'm completely content. I rode the wave of internet fame for at least a year, and it was an absolutely incredible experience. Oh my God. You know, you wake up filled with energy. You wake up filled with adrenaline, but it can get unhealthy at times. And I guess one of the main things that I've done is I've finally removed myself from the pressures of maintaining a YouTube channel. I've removed myself from that. If I want to put up a video, I do. If I do receive a negative comment, I take it on the chin. If I receive a positive comment, that doesn't pump up my ego like it used to, you know. I'm on a much more level playing field. And it's an exciting place to be because that means that anything's possible. I'm never going to be too scared or too shy to put something out on my channel. I'm always going to be myself. And so anyone that is here right now, if you do stick with me, just know that whatever happens on this channel, man, it's always going to be open, honest, 100% me. And anyone else out there that's looking at starting a channel, that is the one thing, the one piece of advice I say every single time. It doesn't matter what your content's like, just be yourself. Because at the end of the day, if you do become successful on YouTube or on whatever platform you're putting yourself out on, and you're not yourself, it's going to bite you in the ass. Anyways, guys, that's enough of that. The best of the linebackers at the 2020 NFL Scouting Combine. Isaiah Simmons. He looks like he's about six foot six, um, and his arms look like octopus arms. They are absolutely huge. He plays for the Clemson Tigers, and let's get into it. I swear I like your style. Put you in Chanel cause this is perfect for your smile. Girl, I swear for you, I run the world, I'd run the mile. The way you look at me, I think I'm going insane. No, that ain't normal. Oh my god, and that ain't normal either. What the fuck? We don't know that. We don't know that. What the hell? Jump of 11 feet. Okay. Let's see what the other guys. Let's see what their reaction was when he jumped. That is not normal. It's the one place he won't play his defensive tackle. Well, we don't know that. We don't know that. Oh, they're not giving much away, are they? Broad jump of 11 feet. Okay. And almost. That's all I'm saying. Watch this outfit for a cape. How much does this guy weigh? How much does he weigh? What was his name again? Well, this kid can't do anything, Chris. That's all I'm saying. Watch this out. It's really dodgy looking up these players because they've already been drafted. Oh my god, I just saw who he got drafted by, for fuck's sake. 6'4, 238. I'm gonna try and forget that as best as I can. 6'4, 238. Okay, I'm gonna try and forget. <laughs> he got drafted to the Cardinals. That's just disappointing. All right. 
outfit him for a cape. There he goes. He's moving. Four, five, six. Looks like a running back. And I, other thing I wrote down about him, I, this guy is an energy guy. He gives energy to his defense. Doesn't he? Oh shit, he floated like a butterfly. That was That was actually beautiful to watch. That was absolutely stunning. Now how do I get this fucking There we go. If this isn't the epitome of floating. I don't know what is. Good. Lock out. That's it. Um, that looks like Cameron Haywood. Or maybe it's just the nose. Pipe man's still going strong. Number 27, my lucky number. Oh, this is... Is this the guy from the... business. When you talk to the people at Oklahoma, this guy had a plan to graduate in three years and take his talents to the NFL, and he was all business. Four, five, two. Ooh. Oh shit, that's where I, I recognize this guy. Yes. In his second run, he pulls up with a hamstring injury. Let's see what happens. I think that is significantly faster, guys, than scouts expected. That is only going to help his stock rise even more. This is the player that everyone's talking Look about. Look at that guy. Your 15 year middle linebacker type that you aspire to have. <laughs> Models this game after Luke Kuechly, like you said. The Ridiculous. The Look at the fucking the physique on him, honestly. His story is incredible. This is a young man who is the son of a pastor and a retired police officer. He helped raise three adopted brothers and sisters who all have special needs. He's playing for a lot more than football, and he is the most respected guy coming out of Oklahoma this entire draft. What a legend. You like him a lot, Charles Davis, don't you? What's not to like when you watch him play? And there's a reason he's a two-time captain with his leadership. 38 inches on the vert. I like that guy. Good lock out. Lock it out. Lock him out all the way up. Lock, lock it out. out. Come on. Gotta lock out. Gotta take it all the way up. Finish the rip. Finish the rip. Lock it out. Two reps of the one rep deduction. 21. Oh, come on, coach. All right. Interesting. We're getting into the nitty gritty now. Okay, we've got three more videos to go, guys. That was the best of the linebacker workouts. I hope you've enjoyed. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. If you want to reach out to me on Instagram, please do. Underscore Jacob McDonald. I have actually created a new Instagram page. It's called Bang Rugby, and it's going to be a YouTube channel too. So it's B-A-N-G Rugby on Instagram and YouTube. So if you love rugby, if you love any of my rugby content, I'm most probably going to upload, you know, the majority of my rugby content to that channel directly. So if you do like rugby, head to Bang Rugby and see what we come up with. But in the meantime, we're here on my own channel, Jake McDonald, and that ain't going to change. In the next video, we've got the best of the simulcam from the 2020 NFL Scouting Combine. Uh, which I always enjoy watching. So with that being said, I hope you have a fantastic day. I hope you're doing as well as possible in these unprecedented times as we keep hearing. And, uh, well, I'll see you in the next one.